We all love this beautiful bird. Some species of this bird have the ability to speak and actually imitate human speech. In order to know how this type of bird can talk, it is good to first have a look at its types, their main habitats and to see which types of this bird are basically capable of speaking. There are more than 394 different species of parrots in the world, most of them live in tropical regions. Parrots have curved and strong beaks that help them break seeds. Some of this type of bird have a short crest and tail and some have a long tail. Parrots eat fruits and edible seeds like hazelnuts. Among the 394 different species of parrots, some of them have the largest number, which we are referring to. Budgerigar or Australian parrot, which was first exported from Australia to other parts of the world in the late 19th century. This beautiful parrot has the ability to imitate speech and has a lovely voice. Its height is about 18 centimeters and its weight is about 45 grams. The average life of this parrot is about 78 years. Brazilian Pygmy Parrot Some believe that this type of parrot first lived in Tanzania and was later exported to other places. This beautiful parrot must be kept as a pair of male and female, otherwise it becomes very violent and nervous. His average lifespan is about 15 years and he does not have the ability to speak and of course he has a loud voice. Rosella Parrot, which is also of Australian origin, and contrary to its colorful and beautiful appearance, is a bit rough. This parrot does not have the ability to speak, but it has a loud voice and sings. Kenyor Parrot, which is also called Solar Kenyor because of its beautiful color that resembles the sunset. This parrot is very smart and has the ability to speak, and of course it is also very active. Eclectus Parrot, which is also from Australia. This parrot ranks third among talking parrots and is very intelligent. Its color is different in male and female species. The female type has a red head, a crimson body and a blue neck, and the male type is green with a blue and black tail. The average life of this parrot is about 75 years. A cockatiel parrot that has a beautiful crest. This parrot also has the ability to speak, although it needs a lot of practice for this. Green Casco, which is considered one of the best talking parrot species. The main habitat of this parrot is Panama and Cuba. Their diet consists of vegetables, fruits and nuts. Malengo Parrot, which has a beautiful appearance and voice, but its ability to speak is not as good as the Casco species. The average life of this parrot is about 15 to 20 years and both male and female pairs are similar. Iskondo Parrot, which is one of the old species of parrot and lives mostly in India and Pakistan. The weight of this parrot is about 250 grams and its height reaches 50 centimeters. A cockatoo that has a white or yellow crest. This parrot is very intelligent and ranks second among talking parrots. Cockatoos lives for about 40 years and its food is fruit and edible seeds. Scarlet Macaw Parrot This bird is exported from South America to other parts of the world. It is very beautiful and colorful and very peaceful. This parrot is smart and has the ability to speak. Blue and Gold Macaw Parrot, which is the largest parrot in the world. Its height reaches 85 centimeters and it lives up to 50 years. It has the ability to speak and is one of the most expensive parrots in the world along with the Scarlet Macaw Parrot. And finally, the African Grey Parrot or Casco. The most intelligent type of parrot that ranks first among talking parrots. This parrot, which is very popular among pet owners, has an average life of about 40 years. Now that we know the types of parrots, let's see how this beautiful bird can speak or actually imitate human speech. The process of speaking in humans, as the most intelligent living creature on earth, is done through the coordination of the brain, vocal cords of the larynx, tongue, and lips. This organism gives humans the ability to speak in such an amazing way that none of the creatures on earth have this ability. There is a part in the human brain that is related to the ability to speak. In this section, in addition to recording the speech comas, commands necessary for correct pronunciation are sent to the vocal cords, tongue and lips. 
And of course, in addition to mental strength and the presence of vocal cords in the larynx, the flexibility of the tongue and lips gives a person the ability to speak. Now the question arises, how can parrots, whose mental capacity is not at the level of humans and do not have organs such as larynx, tongue, and lips like humans, can say words or sentences imitating humans? According to scientists' research, parrot is a bird that is very interested in pair or group life, and in fact, this type of bird tends to communicate. On the other hand, in the brain of this bird, there is the ability to record sound frequencies that are actually of the quality of words and sentences. Of course, scientists realize that this ability to record words is not accompanied by awareness of what they say as words or sentences. In fact, talking parrots only have the ability to imitate dialect, but they do not have the ability to recognize the meaning and meaning of words. Hi. Can you be a little more polite? Yes, Would you like to introduce yourself? Hi. Based on talking parrots' desire to communicate, which we have mentioned, this feeling is in such a way that in case of communication with humans, a kind of positive reinforcement or praise and encouragement arises in them, and in fact, this feeling makes them want to imitate human speech. But for parrots, they don't have tongue and lips like humans, there is an organism called syrinx. This organ does the work of the vocal cords of the larynx for them. The syrinx is located right where the trachea meets the lungs and has vocal folds just like our larynx. The reason parrots can imitate the sounds we need our lips or teeth to make is because their syrinx is much more flexible than our larynx. The two sides of the syrinx can actually vibrate separately, allowing them to accurately copy pitch, volume and word formation to the point where they can even reproduce different human accents. Sound is produced by the vibrations of the syrinx wall. It is interesting to know that some birds, such as the black vulture, do not have this organ. Unlike the human larynx, the syrinx is located near the bifurcation of the lungs, which is why some songbirds can produce more than one sound at a time. Now we understand why and how talking parrots can talk. Having such a beautiful bird that can imitate our conversations can be very interesting and exciting, but it is good to know that the place of life of birds is nature and not the cages we build for them. Nature is more beautiful in its natural form. If you like this video, like it and share it with your friends to support us. Also, subscribe to our channel to see our future videos. Thank you for being with us and supporting us.